Yeah, okay. So here we are. What's up? What? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> this is how we're <laughs> fun and play. <laughs> So is that one of the lessons you want to share? Uh, that you're always safe? That is a really good lesson. Okay, hold on. Well, you you're too far. It's all on me. Okay, Come that's okay. I need maybe you want to hold it? Hi, peeps. So, are we live? We're live. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, cool. So what are we sharing? So we're we're out trying. I have not rollerbladed. Rollerblades. For years and years. And I got skates. Dallas got skates with sparklies. And he looks like that guy. <laughs> I'm that guy. He's wearing that bright guy. colors. Yeah. I just don't have a fanny pack. And he, yeah, fanny pack. <laughs> what else will you require? And we'll, we'll I said, I said if I was wearing a Speedo and a fanny pack. Speedo, fanny pack, no shirt. <laughs> then, I, then I would fully be that guy. You would fully be that guy for sure. <laughs> so uh, I guess what we're, what we're really creating is fun and play. Because yes. one of the things that we talk about all the time is in anything is stick. how does, first off, who's joining us? Say hi. I hi. I hi, Tony. Tony. Hi, Rihanna. Hi, Tony. It's so sunny and nice. Where are you guys? Where, where, where are you located? Showing up. Where in the world? Where in the world is Marcy Lock? Yeah. No, Marcy Lock. Marcy Lock. Marcy Lock. We're checking out all of the Halloween yeah. decorations that everyone's yeah. got up in the neighborhood. Yeah. Because apparently our neighborhood is. Our neighborhood big. supposedly is it's well known for like uh, the most fancy epic, Halloween Halloween lockdown. Stuff. Hi, Anna. Yes, all of the good stuff. Yeah. So, so. So, so, fun Nick, and play. Fun and play. Hi, guys. Okay, so this is the thing. I haven't roller skated forever. He just got skates just to create some more play. He's like, how can I create more oh, fun, New more Zealand. play, yeah. more vibration? What? From New Zealand. Hi. Ah, New Zealand. Awesomeness. And so one of the one of the concepts we're always asking ourselves, one of the things that I always do, is how can I, how can I create more joy? So one of my even goals this week was like to ask myself more often is like, am I experiencing joy right now? If I'm not experiencing joy, how could I create that? How can I create more joy? How can I create more joy? Mm -hmm. So Dallas already <laughs> decided to get skates, and I'm like, I have rollerblades. Let's go try this out. Uh, downhill. You got to speed up. Oh, <laughs> Here we go. So let's go and get outside and, and see what it would be like to rollerblade and roller skate again, create some fun and some play, yeah. because I promise you, do a hand plant. No, no, Jason Moffat. No, Jason. Jason, you do not. You do not want to cause us harm. I'm just learning. How, I'm learning how to stop on well, these let's things. Let's talk about this. Oh, what we're would, always safe. What always would safe. keep people from taking that step, right? Like yeah. first, I was like, well, you know, there's just the sidewalks. We have these big ass heels. I'm like, where would? And he's like, oh, we'll just go straight up and we'll we'll just start on the road. We'll just take it a step at a time. So when you when a lot of times when we want to go create something, our mind goes, well, I would need this or I can't because. And it's like, well. How would that be possible? What's the next step I could take? What? How can I just try it? So this even applies in business. Look, I'm like, I'm like loving this wind thing, okay? And someone the other day was talking to me about uh, um, that you know they want to be able to create this thing in their business, and it's like an either-or game. So I'm like, well, you know, instead of planning it out and thinking it through, what if you just were like, huh? How would what, would, what would the first easiest thing be for me to start moving towards that? So the same thing applies in every area of your life. So if you're not willing to just go. This sounds good, this feels good, how can I try that? How can I now experience that and give myself permission to try that? Yeah. Then we're actually yeah. you know, blocking ourselves from totally. all the fun and play that's available. Totally. Instead of creating obstacles before you even start, right? Well, it's like the hills are dangerous and I don't have equipment and all this other story oh, you could come up with. Where earlier, we're like, <laughs> yeah. Watch this, watch this. Uh... We don't, we don't actually know what those things are for. I guess, I don't, it doesn't slow down traffic. I think it's just supposed to look cool. But I, with little wheels, it's dangerous, so. Oh, and we've got our little security going through the neighborhood. Hi. <laughs> so these, these are the hollow, oh, look at this, babe. This person's house. That's cool. Right? They just wanted a crazy life. Oh, that's right? Cool. I don't, I don't think I don't think they knew I don't think they knew that they were gonna be uh, their house is gonna be on uh, on Facebook, Facebook Live, Live with Marcy yeah. Locke. Yeah, and Dallas. Mike so anyway, what, what we, what we want to do is just encourage you to get out there and play. Don't overthink it. 
because honestly getting out there and having fun and playing does lead to more abundance it well, leads to more joy it leads to more fulfillment that's the whole point if at yeah. all you're feeling any lack or scarcity in your life um, if you're feeling <laughs> anything missing then the then it's to um, to be able to give that same thing just like if you're feeling a lack of love you go give love okay yeah. that's so if you're if you're in a low vibration all you're gonna create is more lack and scarcity. All you're gonna create is more resistance. The moment you go, huh, okay, awesome. Like what would feel good? It is a beautiful house. This whole, house, this whole neighborhood is massively yeah. beautiful houses. So it's, it's how would I create the energy of feeling good? And that doesn't take money. You can, you can you know, turn on some music. And that's why one of the, um, one of the tools that I give my clients is an hourly check-in when they first start with me mm -hmm. because then it's like we are taking massive radical responsibility totally. of being proactive and catching ourselves and what's going on internally that's keeping us from that mm -hmm. so if uh, you know your alarm goes off if you set your alarm and it goes off and the whole point is just to do an internal check-in to be able to say you know what am, what am I creating right now what's the thoughts going on in my head oh all of a sudden you notice that you were having a thought and thinking something that was not gonna support you it was thinking like you know, oh, I'm worried about this launch, or I'm worried about, you know, this, or, or any negative thought, or that you're, and you're feeling bad. That could be that you're feeling sad. And when we, we, we don't even realize that we're projecting these things, and so when you walk through, and it's like, oh, wait. So now even if you're experiencing awesomeness, it's like, well, how can I experience more awesomeness? Shh, skating, right? <laughs> like, it's like, if this was as awesome as I could feel, like if this was 100% this was awesome, how could I take this up a notch? How could I take this up 50%? So we want to bring ourselves back to awesomeness. So if we're not, when we catch ourselves feeling low vibe, the, high, the best thing you can understand is living your life in high vibration. High vibration frequency is what attracts everything else to you that is high vibe. You want more opportunity? Go create some high vibes. Whatever that is, by giving out love, by creating joy, by doing a dance, by, but yet you get to feel your feelings and walk through it, but then we get to go create high vibe. Yeah. High vibe. High vibe. How, Soulful Sunday hi, and... High five, high vibe. Uh, wait, high five. wait, what's our high five? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you've got that. Okay. Ouch. <laughs> you got it's because you put these on me. Because he's like, I want my I want lover you to be safe. safe. Yeah. So I'm like, eh. <laughs> those are those are wrist guards. Those are wrist yeah, guards. and we're also singing musicals. Well, we've been out. We've yeah. been like, sing, sing. our life is like a musical. What if every moment it was song? <laughs> so mine is like funny singing. Oh, yeah. there we go. And Dallas oh, is no. like professional singer, which yeah. is awesome. Yeah. Cool. Well. Okay. Anything else gonna... you want to share? <laughs> right when we go for the bumpy Don't part. die! <laughs> <laughs> we're almost there. <laughs> and we're safe. We've arrived. Oh, slingshot. So, oh, yeah, slingshot. Let's rock out a slingshot. Ready? I'm slingshot, going. Marcy Lock. Okay, you gotta speed up first. Ready? Okay, you better do it now because there's the bumpy beats. Be on free! Yeah, let's have a slow slingshot. Yeah. <laughs> Last time we had a hill. All right, everybody. We love you. Have Peace a good out. Peace out. Couldn't make life.